Hi, I'm Drew Moyer, and this is how to find the equation for a line using matrices. Since lines are often written in matrix form, that means that we can work backwards, given a matrix, to find the equation of a line. So our matrix is here, and I know that these values must correspond to a line in standard form. And actually, this matrix corresponds to two separate lines because there are two rows. So I know that this 3 must be my A term, which means it corresponds to x. So I have 3x, and this 1 must co uh, correspond to a y value, which means it's 1y, or just y. And then over here on my right side, I would have my C value, which for the first equation is going to be 5. So there's my first line, 3x plus y equals 5. And again, it's in standard form. And now let's do our second equation, which again, this 2 is going to correspond to our a term. So it's going to be 2x. This negative 1 corresponds to our b term, or our y term. And again, I don't have to write the 1, so I can just say plus negative y. And it's going to be equal to 0, which is our c term for our second line. So now we have, for our second line, 2x plus negative y, or just minus y, equals 0. I'm Drew Moyer, and this is how to find the equation of a line using matrices.